Well, good afternoon. It's my birthday today. Despite the fact that I'm 50 in our 50s, um, it's a wonderful day. I'm in Devon. I'm about to go for a walk on the River Yam or the River Yelm. I don't know how you pronounce it, but anyway, it's a nice little estuary. Hopefully, the tide will be out according to my tide times. And hopefully we're going to see some birds on the estuary. Happy days. Well, we just arrived at the estuary and uh, the tide is out, which is great. Um, I can see already some widgeon as I look around. Um, there's a few of the distant birds, which I'll try and get a bit closer and have a good look. But it's beautiful, I'll show you now. Here's the estuary, it's where the river Yelm runs out. Absolutely beautiful right here. And that's it. Some hazy sunshine, which is great. So I think I'm just going to sit and see what comes around. I think has finally paid off. Um, there's a red shank. It's about 100 metres away. I'm just trying to remember when I used to play golf. Yeah, about 100 metres. Um, so it's still relatively small in the frame, but actually um, you can crop in a bit and we should be all right. Let me just show you where he is anyway. just right out in front of me in the water so <clears throat> I'm just um, I'm using the 1.4 extender again one to 400 lens uh, I'm on 16 hundredths of a second ISO is a thousand at the moment uh, and it's on f8 oh you can see the curlews as well calling it's just beautiful here absolutely stunning what a view what a way Spend an afternoon. So this is one of the shots I got. It's zoomed in quite considerably, as you can see from the little thing on the bottom. But um, and it always, always looks better on the back of the camera, always. So as I say, again, as usual, I won't know until I get them on the computer. But actually, on the face of it, not looking too bad. Just needs lightening up a bit. But um, yeah, not bad. Quite hopeful for these.
lot. That's interesting. Um, just in the woods opposite. It's over there. Somebody just fired a um, shotgun. <laughs> I was discussing earlier. And uh, subsequently, pretty much every single bird took flight. So everything's basically buckered off now. Um, I think I did manage to catch a couple of pictures of them flying off. There you go. That's exactly what I'm talking about. Uh, I'm trying to think of the words. I'm in the most stunningly beautiful place you could imagine. Look at that. Absolutely gorgeous. It's surrounded by wildlife. And it's like it's like a war zone. <laughs> I don't know what to think about it. <laughs> I'm a little bit scared to be honest because um, somebody's shooting guns right next to me. So, anyway, let's persevere. Yeah, the light's starting to go a bit now and um, to be honest, ever since that shotgun went off about two yards from here, um, nothing's come back really. That was a All right, well, I think uh, we've had the best of the sun now. Um, I'll say everything did disappear, but there's some birds starting to come back in now. But um, I think the light is not going to be good enough to do any any more um, decent photography. So we'll call it a day, I think. What a magnificent day, though. Absolutely stunning. You never know, we might just see something on the way back. There's a couple of little egrets, but they're right on the other side of the estuary over there. Quite a long way away, so. Uh, so we'll do the usual, get back, have a look at the pictures on the computer, see if we've got anything usable, put them up for you if we have. And uh, hopefully every time I do this, I'll try new techniques, improving my skills and hopefully things do improve so uh, it's all good so till next time unless I see anything else on the way back see you again Just on my way home, um, I was doing a shot of me walking over the bridge and I went to position the phone down by the river and um, dropped it in the river <laughs> and incredibly it's still working, all power to the iPhone that's what I say.